I don't gotta stay silent during shit. Oh Get the man. fuck out of here, yeah? We got nothing to yeah. do today, yeah? I don't play by dee, no dee, rules, dee, cuz. Dee, dee. What? Oh, Michael's fresh out of work. Fresh He's talking to the in, That's in, it. through the intro. Do the intro. Dum, dum. Welcome back Welcome to back. episode 13 of Nothing dee. to Do Podcast. I'm your host, Jeremy. Across from me is your host, Michael. How you doing, Michael? Happy Juneteenth, by the way. But how you doing, Michael? I'm doing good. How are you? I'm doing pretty well, man. I can't complain. Uh, it's Friday. It is Friday, but I feel every day is Friday for me. Word. <laughs> Not for me. Today's Friday. Today I got to enjoy Friday, these days. Friday. It's right. Sweaty Balls Friday. I just came out of work. It, it looks like I pissed myself, but I guarantee, I'm telling you, um, for all the future viewerships, we're going to show this later. Uh, sweat. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I didn't urinate sweat. myself. Talk to me, Jamie. What's going on? And uh, I'm chilling, man. I just been st- I still been on this day to day diet that I was telling you about. Where? Still working out. Is I actually it? fucking punched the bag off the fucking hinges the other day. Is it so it doesn't have a stand? It's on a hinge on the. It's like there's like so on the ceiling. There's like a wooden panel that that Jamie screwed onto it. Yeah. And then from there he he screwed onto the wooden panel like hinge. a hinge. Yeah. And it swings from that. Yeah. And I broke the hinge off. And I felt like fucking Captain America. Did I'll tell you, you that. Yeah. <laughs> you yeah. know, talking about yeah. that for the first oh, Avengers was, movie. Oh, it was a shoddy uh, carpentry. <laughs> hey work. man, no, nah, no, nah, don't hey, take this hey, away from me. Oh, it was shoddy stop, carpentry. Stop playing, work. stop playing with me. What are the other? No, no, no. It, it could have definitely nah, been you that. No, nah, it was. A, it definitely metal. a mix of both. You bent, you bent it's, that it's shit, bro. It's no, definitely no, you did that. You did that. And just so y'all know, those hands are for show. I'm a, I'm a man of, I'm a man of peace. You know I'm a lover, not a fighter. Oh no, no! I thought you so, meant like my hands are for sure. Like no, yeah, no, I got for sure. Hands. But but that, be, that being said, I'll put them to work if I need to. I'll but I'm a lover, not a fighter. on you. The hands work on the bag. I don't know about you know. You hurt. A sco- a That's what happens score. when you when you uh, start hitting the bag a lot. Then you're gonna be like, "Fuck! I need to test this out, see if it really works." Right. And then the first little argument when you get with it, somebody, you fucking see. You I hope I don't become that person because yeah. I've never been that person. And then you'd be like, wow, Jeremy, look at you. You get a little, you get some muscles and look at you. You don't know how to act. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's funny. But it is what it is. Who knows? Maybe somebody will get folded this weekend. I'm going to New York. Or you could get folded. Or, or I could and get like folded. That could, that's another possibility. That's, that's, that's If you had to put your money on that, you probably would bet that I well, would Well, no, nah, I got to see the other guy. <laughs> I got to see the other person. Nah, same weight class. No, I got you. I believe in you. Hey, hey, I appreciate it. How much you weigh right now? Solidarity. What? How much you weigh right now? Oh, like 142 right now. I dropped like 13 Holy pounds in all this. Shit. I was like 155. You remind me of fucking, we was at Steven's birthday party. He told me he was like down a buck 50. So I'm like, yo, you boys are fucking skinny, bro. Yeah, but I'm, yeah. That 145? todo tu sabes, muscles. He cuts. Still too skinny, bro. Like, <laughs> it's, it's, it's like, it's like you 140. Sound like my grandmother. Ay, muchacho, tú estás demasiado you flaco. Eat? You need to Dude, eat. I'm eating, bro. You know, but I'm working eat out. More. It's my body eat type. Eat more. Eat more. Eat steaks, bro. Oh, don't talk to Steven about steaks. Why? He's, he's on his vegan shit. He's still on that? Actually, I don't know. I don't think he is. Uh, but I doubt it. That you get more protein you get for a purpose. I don't know. He put on a documentary for me a couple weeks ago. I mean, I've been listening to some guy. For that performance switched. purposes, like ve- ve- veganism is the shit. Is it? Because yeah. I, I don't know. Because I've seen some guys that... Uh, Di- I'm swearing by a carnivore diet. It's both. Yeah, I see that, that Joe Rogan shit. He yeah. did that for he did that for a month. And he said he said I never he's never felt that jack ever right. in his life. Right. Maybe yeah, it's just so like whatever works for you, yo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. My McDonald's is working for me just yeah. fine. Yeah, <laughs> hurt. Might get a McDouble right oh, after shit. this. Yeah. What else is new though? Um, the NBA, bro. Kyrie trying to trying to trying to stop this shit, bro. Um, what do you think? Now, is it are they trying to stop it because like of what? Just because of the because co- of everything that's going. On. I not I don't nah. not COVID, but in terms of police brutality and just like Black Lives, I think that's I think what the whole thing is that a lot of people think that with everything going, every there's so much focus on this on this issue right now, and everybody it's got literally everybody's attention that like going back to playing the NBA without getting something out of it maybe is like. So what are you doing? You're just like obviously like there's always been protest like uh, like activism in sports. Like I don't have to fucking go through the list even like within the last year. But like, yeah, I don't know. People didn't think that they should hold out and not play, and because it's something bigger, people think they should play because ob- at the end of the day, it's their, it's their jobs, and like they got families to feed and all that. So for sure, not everybody's yeah. a superstar with right. a fucking max contract. Right, you know what I mean, right. the dudes is like 
There's some dudes that need that. Like, yep. they're dying to go back over there. And si, like, senor. I mean, not on some LeBron shit that I want to win the ship and, like, uh, continue my legacy. See, that, like, Yeah, right. That's the only thing is, too, is just, like, I don't know. I don't know about you. Um, I do understand that families need to be fed. Obviously, for, like, there's for the not LeBrons and the KDs and the Kyries. And then, like, on top of Kyrie just having a history of just, like, wiling the fuck out. Yeah. And then... But I feel like that being said, I feel like there's a point to like not playing because it's just like. It's so no uh, major sports to play then, right? We should cancel one of right. We should and cancel MLB. That's, that's exactly why. That's exactly why it's uh, it's a we? bigger discussion. It's, I don't know, but that being said, especially with the NBA and and like their public stance on this, because MLB don't like like that shit's cute. MLB is changing the logos. People like changing logos, but like MLB is changing what, that your logo. I didn't it, know. No, they have like a little Black Lives Matter. Like they turn the MLB uh, thing back. Uh, like you know what I'm saying? A little uh, cute shit, which. Yeah. Whatever, it's a gesture, but, like, where the fuck is your money going? You know what I'm saying? And I think that's what's important with the NBA, especially, like, how open and the players are about issues like this. Like, you got a bunch of billionaires by the balls because they're losing money because you're not playing. So let's try and get something out of it. As in what? What are we trying to get out of it? I don't know. Mm. But, like, some, some sort of change, whether it's, like, within, like, sports... Maybe like legislation, maybe the way they, I don't know some. So because we're I, gonna I hold down an NBA, that's we're a, gonna. That's, a, that's the conversation. I mean, this is this is my problem that I see with with the whole with the Black Lives Matter movement going on right now, and yeah. I'm all for it. But it's like there's too many things being attached to it that like don't make sense. Like it just don't make sense, bro. There's people out here now talking about uh, not only de- like defund the police, cool, they get too much money, but. If we're gonna, if you're gonna think you're gonna be on some Seattle on, on autonomous zone bullshit, like yeah. we can't be, we can't be mixing that with Black Lives Matter. Like that's that's totally different, bro. We need cops. Sorry, we need cops. Don't ever fucking think that you don't need fucking cops in this world, bro. Right. I think we, the, you are fucking out of your mind if you don't think we you need cops. We just gotta rethink what the police is. For that sure. Shit, that shit happened in New Jersey. I don't know how long ago. I read something quick on it. Uh, where like New Jersey was known for having like the most corrupt fucking police department in the in the nation or whatever, Word. and they completely just kind of dis- dismantled that way that system worked in New Jersey, and they did it with, like, a new police system that's, okay. like, working now. So it's a lot of stuff like that. Like, I think, the t- I think the term, like, defund the police is doing exactly what it's supposed to do, which is, like, get the conversation going because, like, there's people that's, that read that and have that initial reaction that, like, you or some other people might have or just, like, what do you mean defund the police? Like, take all the money no, away? No, no, no. Like, I knew what defund the police was. Yeah. Okay. You know what I mean? But it's, like, it's like yeah, like, they're taking it to a whole nother level after that, though. It's, like, that's not the only thing. Like, mm-hmm. like, like uh, they don't want to play the um, national anthem before games in high school. Yeah, like is that is that t- they're not trying to serve? They're not trying to let cops inside the universities to use their bathroom. Like what? Oh, I didn't read. Like about what are we? That what are, like yo, there's I mean, mad things like that is going on. Yeah. Like it's just like, like, like the, we want to cancel Paul Patrol because he has a there's a do- <laughs> like come on, let's <laughs> cut this shit. Patrol. Let's cut this shit. Let's really really cut the shit, bro. Like come on, that's not gonna help nobody. Paul Patrol, you want to oh, cut him because he's a fucking police dog. Like, like, Fucking make sense, oh, bro. Man. Legos, no, you, no you, more cop Legos. You know what it That's is? A bad, like what? Without, what is like, it? Without disrespecting the movement, because obviously I'm all for it. If, especially if y'all heard the last three episodes or whatever. But this is this this movement. I feel like is at a, at like the turning at the point which the, like the Me Too movement was like whatever over five many five years ago. Mm. Where it's like now. Like that, this shit's put on fire, like super blast. Even though it's been going on for so long, especially within the last five years, like we have so much video. Like now, there's gonna be like this overcorrection of shit. And you people, you can define what overcorrection means to you in terms of how do you want to address it. Whether it's you know canceling Paw Patrol, it's like all right, chill. Whether it's you know what I'm saying. But I feel like that's where we're at with police brutality. And I feel like like the Me Too movement as tricky as the conversation you get when you kind of start breaking down individual situations i think it's what is necessary what is to, necessary to like to, to cancel actually, all to no, cancel to like, all images of cops no 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 to like just move it forward to change the perception around police and to like change the conversations of where we have about police and like race this is not country. this is not that's i i think that that's what it is because that, that's what the me i feel like that's what the correction of the me too movement was or is it's still a movement obviously like you know, girls ain't still ain't trying to get like sexually assaulted out here, but like until they win Oscars, then they <laughs> were they was at that time. <laughs> oh man, when they was winning them Yo, Oscars, Michael they were showing them out. They were showing them out on the on the on the podiums. Harvey, I want to think Harvey. <laughs> I want to think Harvey 
and that little penis of his <laughs> for getting me up here on the stage. I, I can't thank you enough. So horny right now. Come on, bro. Come on. Cut the shit. Oh, Cut the shit. Man. It's Friday. It's Sweaty Balls it is, Friday. It is fucking you hot. Hurt? And it's hot in the studio. You hurt? It's hot as balls in the studio. I just, I just, I don't know. There's like, there's things that is just like, it's getting like, man, I keep hearing more and more things like every day. Like I'll read something and I'm just like, this is, this is getting ridiculous now. It really is just getting like, yeah, I, I don't. I don't get it. I really don't get it, bro. Yeah. I don't. There's something like, like, canceling Paw Patrol is just like, what? Canceling Legos? Is that really going to do something? They're canceling Legos or like police Cause, Legos? Because it's police Legos. <laughs> so you're going to tell me that Kyrie Irving to not go to the NBA, that's going to make a dif- That's going to be the difference right there? Well, that, but, that, but see, that's, a, that's the thing that's the difference with the NBA because these players actually have influence over the money that travels through that fucking sport, which is why I say... Which is why, you know, I do kind of side on that for a little bit. Obviously, like, I would love to fucking see people play. Like, LeBron's my favorite player, and this year's his chip year. But, you know, like, if you got if you got that much money and that much power by the Bulls, like, try and get something out of it. Because that's at the end of the day. That's, like, that's what matters most. It's, like, obviously all these... Because, like, yeah, like, the fact that Juneteenth is being recognized as an official holiday, I think that's great. I think, obviously... um. You Knocking know, the, off all, all these stuff. fucking racist statues is right. amazing too. I think, oh yeah, all that take stuff. all that shit out of here. Right? Take Get all that out. shit out of here. I don't right? want to see all that bullshit. All these, all these organizations and stuff, you know, ch- saying Black Lives Matter, like with the logos and changing logos or whatever, pledging their solidarity. See, that's this is, that's this is cool. What, but at the end of the day, that shit is it's cute, fake. and I want to know where it's your money's fake. going when it it's comes fake. to all this shit. That's why. That's I, what I want to know. A, a lot, like, like a lot of people are just saving face at this point. They're just saving face. Yeah, I think a lot of people. Like, did you see? Did you see the celebrities with the with the with taking a stand? Like the, white, the, the white celebrities where bro, they're just like, I, bro, yo, this bro, dude. bro, I was ready to throw <laughs> yo, something. I was ready to throw something. I got so pissed. That was the dumbest shit yo, I've ever bro, seen in my entire bro, life. I got so livid, bro. bro like, I was ready to. I got. I'll send you the video after we finish recording this. But there's this this like Instagram comedian type. His name Casey Fry. He's hilarious, and he makes he does a little parody on that video. Yeah. And it's too and funny. It's just, yeah, it's hilarious because literally like the parody takes place. It's just like right like ten seconds before they cut, and he's just like like he's literally getting ready for like an, an acting role. Which yeah, is yeah, what yeah. the fuck it looked like because on some level that's what it was. Like that shit was so weird and phony. And yeah, maybe white people, your heart's in the right place when you do shit like that. But y'all gotta realize how fucking tone deaf you fucking. Yo, sound. white people, I love you. <laughs> Now's yeah, the time to just shut the fuck up. Shit is tone deaf as fuck. Just, just be quiet. The, there were, and yo, what I, what I did like about not like about it, but like I was, there was no like one, none of those actors. I didn't really, I wasn't particularly in any a fan of them, so I wasn't like I didn't watch. It, I was like, yo, not you, bro. You see, you see Except Jesse for, from Back that was and Bad. That was you the said, only one. You said, damn, Jesse, that was, you. Only, that was the only one, and he was the worst one because he looked like he was literally playing his role yes he looked like he was yes. jesse pinkman doing that yes i'm like bro come on what are you doing my guy what are you? and i love jesse pinkman bro i like aaron paul and, and a lot of people and, just trying to say so it's like God it's like damn. it's like it's like if they if like it's like they went up to him and said yo you we you should do this and if they would have said no then would they would have got labeled as racist like that's the right. that's the part part that we're on now like like i could i could definitely see someone Looking at this and be like, "Oh, Mike's racist." Look, look at the comments he's saying. Right. Like, you know what I mean? Like, right. that's the fucking point that we're on. Like, mm-hmm. it's either you're on with us or you're racist. Right. Like, it's too left and right now again. Right. Just like this political system, bro. I'm like, I'm. I don't understand it, bro. Right. I don't understand it. We can sit here and try to educate me all you want. I, I just, <laughs> I don't understand it, bro. I feel like the Black Lives Matter movement is like getting mixed up with fucking Antifa. And all this, that's a, you know what I mean? Like, that's it's all with, getting blurred together, bro. I, I feel like that's Sorry, thing with it what, is. With, with what's going on in general is, like, I feel like there's no, like, we have no, like, solid, like, leaders right now. Thank you. We don't have, like, give we, me we the, don't have, Give me that voice. Like, we don't like, have that solid voice, and Black Lives Matter has never been that in the sense that, like, there's no there's no one person that represents Black Lives Matter. As I found in this, this is my mission. Like, yep. we know their mission, but, like, they, they're so spread out. And like, there's, they're not, they're not that centralized. So it's like we, like, like you just said, we don't have, we don't have leaders like that. So we do, we do a lot of it. Just like taking up, like doing shit on our own, figuring this out as people together. It's just like whether it's over posting on social media, whether it's overcorrecting this. Yeah, I don't. Maybe like some of this shit is a little phony and like irrelevant in the long term. But it's just like it's the process of figuring shit out, working shit out in general. So I think, yeah. <clears throat> but I, I see where I definitely see where you're coming from. You know what I'm saying? Word. 
Uh, next topic. I came in. He came in hot. But I like, came in here. Like I came here. I'm just like, I'm like, yo, finally a regular podcast. We don't gotta talk about none of this shit that's going on here. We can just fucking win. And look, right back into right it. Right back into it. We right can't back, escape I mean, it. You can't escape we it. Thought about it's it the with, world. We thought it with COVID. It's the it's world. It's like fucking four or five. It's the world. Four more. Yeah, it's the world, man. It's the world we're living in. So this is what this podcast is for. So yeah, you see Takashi Six Nine out here fucking doing songs and and, and um, people no, getting given him no, clout. No, I, I try. I tried to not see that. Like my hardest. Like I tried my hardest. Well, but if you didn't see Michael, I didn't see it. And to our millions of fans, but out I seen uh, what he got a song with Akon now. They remix locked no, up. No, no, he got it. <laughs> they got remix locked up for real. Akon, that's what you're doing. You're gonna build fucking Wakanda and you're gonna fucking come back and. Uh, uh. So he got a song out with Nicki now. It's called Trolls. Yes. Which I don't care how bad you're trolling, yo. No matter how how you fucking align yourself with Takashi Six Nine, is does not look good. I don't give a fuck. I mean, I mean, you I can don't never say fuck. that he's a good rapper either. Like, no, of course never. not. Like, I seen the one clip with him and Akon, right? I didn't watch the Nicki video. I didn't. I don't even. I haven't heard the song yet. Thank God. Like that hasn't like just popped up on the radio or some shit. Like, that, first off, he can't get no radio play, right? Ain't no radio playing that, right? And his shit? Yeah. I, I haven't heard it. There's his no way. Shit, his new There's shit, no way heard. that no radio station out there is playing this shit. And the clubs, the DJs don't play shit at the clubs. You think so? I don't think they will. I don't think they will neither. I don't think, I think they'll lose credit. I feel like they will lose fucking credibility <laughs> if they start playing. Well, that one Akon you know clip saying? I seen, like. I, I didn't even know about the bad. Akon shit. I'm looking at it right now. And I was like, yo, I love it's, Akon too. And that's a, Yeah, that's no, not that's an elf Akon. Yeah, that's an elf Akon. Got a, he got an elf Akon. I got to read into this more, but that's. So I hear that. Um. Uh. So he broke the internet record with that video, trolls, right, on YouTube. Okay. And uh. So it was like something like hundred, almost hundred fifty million views in twenty four hours. But then the Spotify only had like two million downloads, right? Mm. So I forgot. It was like Adam Twenty Two. You know that interview or whatever. He be doing all these uh little. He does a little podcast. Adam Twenty Two. Yeah. I think I know you're talking about. So uh, he's like, oh, something don't smell right. You know what I mean, like, mm-hmm. how does that? How do you have so many views over here, but over here? Yeah. Bots, so, Russian bots, bots, bots yeah. for sure. That uh, YouTube came out a couple of days ago, and they uh they took back his record because mm-hmm. there's faulty uh there's faulty stats on it. So he's like he not only is he a bum, but he's like a bum bum even in his music. Yeah, bro, he's paying dudes and fucking. Uh, but I came from like his shit was knocking in the in what was when knocking. You go out in the club when you hear the oh before, before before all the shit. Yes. Yeah, that shit, yes. Get, that shit was fucking shit. lit. Shit. It did get you hyped. It get you fucking hyped. It did get you hyped. For sure. He's not on my fucking my workout playlist. I'll tell you that, though. Oh, he's not? I heard. I thought no. he was like listening to Gummo and shit. You still. I wish I could, but no. Yeah, no, yeah. It, 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 it won't again, let you. Again, against my code. It's against your again. code. Yep. <laughs> I respect that. I respect that. He been he been canceling in my book. Yeah. We're gonna cancel his ass. He yeah, should have got he's canceled. The, he's he should have got canceled. All the canceling that's one going on. Cancel per year, twenty twenty. Takashi six nine. Get out of here, yeah. What? Get him the fuck out of here. Uh, what about baseball? What's going on with baseball, Jamie? Because you probably know more than me. I heard. Not even a, yo. Honestly, I've just gotten so used to not being around sports that I forget that it's like a thing <laughs> that they're not around right now. But last thing I heard is like with they announced a date to start the season. Rob Manfred, the commissioner. And then he took it back mm. for some reason. I don't know if it was after everything happened. I heard happened like the George Players Floyd. Association and that, and him aren't really. They're not, yeah, they're not. I saw this one clip on Barstool of this fucking, who I think is a no-name dude from the Braves, going on a rant about how he wants his money. And he's like, you said we were going to play. And then you said that we're not going to play. And you said you were going to give us our money, yep. but you only want to give us 75% of our money. It just felt annoying. First off, him. baseball players, y'all, y'all get way too much <laughs> yeah, money. Yeah, <laughs> y'all get, y'all get so much money to they begin get too with. Much. And they still, like, Manny Ramirez is still getting paid. He's getting paid for, for like, sure. another seven years. Like, the way those contracts yeah, work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Luol Deng still got paid this year from the Lakers. They, they The NBA is kind of like that, too? Yeah, kind of like that, too. God damn. Luol Deng's getting Laker money still? Yeah, he still he got He hasn't like, retired yet, has he? Or just He played, he just played like, three games, I think, and got, like, 17 mil. That's amazing. Shout out Luol Deng. Yeah. <laughs> remember when he was good? I remember when he used to be I good, do, too. I do, just because just two, his 2K rating was above 80, whatever. So, I do remember. What 2K uh, was this? It was like 2K10. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I wasn't wrong. I'm mm-hmm. not wrong. You sure? Yeah. Okay. What I is it? Can oh. you confirm? You don't want to confirm? Oh, yeah. yeah. I could let me look wrong, it up right I, now. I, yeah, let me look <laughs> it up right now. Podcast, hold on. Let me see what 2K... Uh, ding, 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 ding. What 2K was that Luol Deng was above an 80? <laughs> <laughs> this, is why, uh, this is why we need to get video up. <laughs> this is why uh, we need to get video up. 
I feel like I feel like mad naked in the studio where I don't have my laptop and shit, but I never use it. It's not yeah. like I ever use it for anything. Right. I just like it's the vibes. Yeah, it is the vibe. It. I don't use that. I, I mean, like you don't use it. I remind. We don't me. look shit up. No, I do. Do you? Yeah, I, I do. I don't. Sometimes I I'll look shit up and then like we start talking and then we just I guess we just both bad ADD and the conversation switch. So like I'll have like shit up information from like the conversation from ten minutes from ago. five minutes ago because yeah. the shit just. I just goes. I'm not quick with it yet, but I'll get it. I feel like we we don't be staying on topic long enough for you to research anything, anyways. Right, exactly. We just we, we bounce around a lot. Exactly. <laughs> That's us. So you us. fuck with it, or fuck you. How about I've, that, I've been listening to uh, I listened to that new Freddie Gibbs album. Yeah, you like it, right? It's good, Alfredo. Yeah, it was really yeah. Good. it's real good. I gave it a front to back, um, and now I'm going to the tracks individually. I like that one with Benny Butcher. Benny the Butcher. Oh, it's really good. It's really good. I want to say That's that I've been ones. fuck. It's heavy rotation on my shit, but I, I went through it. A couple yeah. times and um yeah I was happy and Drew shout out to Drew he's been putting me on because after we did that music episode and Drew was uh, kicking at the crib for a while and he was playing like, he always like he still really fucks with that sound of hip hop and he knows like all the new dudes the new niggas that fucking mm. are still out here so he's been putting me on the match shit so shout out to him because mm. I was like yeah I need to start listening to this fucking style of rap again why because after I listened to started listening to Griselda and getting back into Griselda and then listening to West Side Gun, I was like, you know what? I miss this shit. I miss I this need, style of I rap. Need, like, Cole just dropped the track. Well, I'm gonna, I'm Have you gonna, heard it yet? Yeah, I heard it. I don't even want to get into all that yeah, controversy I was, we, with it. We, we were touching that on that like 10 minutes ago. Yeah, Kinda, I don't yeah. want. I don't want to get into all that because it's just like, yo, them like like you can't even be critical with anybody no more. Like, yeah, you can't even give them like constructive criticism, bro. Like, how are we supposed to stop ignorance, bro? If we don't fucking spread knowledge, that's though? facts. I don't understand this and, shit, bro. And that, the J Cole's the J Cole's problem, or not his problem, that like, he didn't create it himself. It's just like people put him on that. I mean, he might have like, obviously, he did kind of like, I guess, lean into it. Like that image or like that, I guess, quote unquote brand. I don't even know if I want to call it a brand, but so like, so because he's trying to educate himself and he hasn't came out, we gotta, we gotta, uh, no, 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 no. What, I'm, what I'm saying is that people put their perceptions of that on, on him, and that's why people maybe feel let down. Like, I don't feel let down. That's, that's, that was my whole point of the episode two years ago. Like, we're still all learning about this shit, even if you're somebody like J. Cole. I wanna, I wanna, you know? I want everyone, uh, uh, that's listening, if you fuck with me, uh, I want you to go and listen to Joe Rogan's podcast with a guy named Daryl Davis, right? Daryl Davis. I gotta listen to this one. Daryl Davis converted two hundred members of the Ku Klux Klan. Black man, black man converted two hundred members of the crew. You That's gotta incredible. listen. Hold you on, gotta listen. What? Yo, if there's a leader to the Black Lives Matter movement, it should be him. Darryl, it should it? be him. <laughs> what is it? it should Darryl? be fucking Daryl Davis, dog. Dude converted <laughs> two hundred. Darrell Davis. Darrell Davis. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I said Darrell Revis. Cause that's no, what no, no, no. <laughs> yeah, no, no. I, I, that might not even be his name. I should look look it up real quick. See if I'm. If that's his name. Darrell Davis, basketball player. No, no da, definitely not. He's very he, large. Daryl. Uh, Put Darrell Davis KKK. How one man convinced 200 Ku Klux to make Klan Yo, members y'all to gotta, give y'all gotta 2017. Listen to this podcast, Jesus bro. Christ. Y'all gotta listen to this man, bro. This man is fucking fearless, bro. Yo, bro, like he <laughs> sat down with Klu- with KKK leaders, bro, <laughs> and interviewed him to see where, where, like, he could he could pinpoint where is this ignorance coming from? Like, how? Mm-hmm. How, do, how can you not like me? You don't even know me. Yeah. Like, how? How is that even possible? Yeah. So... If anybody got, if y'all got time in two and a half hours to kill, I suggest. Shout out to Daryl Davis. That's actually. I suggest fucking like, that's, listening to that. That's wild. I never knew that story. That's, that's, that's interesting. Please, spot. please, Jamie, when you got time, please listen to that shit. Well, that, what that just means is that there's hope for everybody, right? Yo. Is that what it is? Yo. There's hope just, for everybody. Yo, ignorance is solved by knowledge. That's why bro. just be patient and educate yourselves. And not even educate yourselves, but yo, like, like. Be willing to be educated. Like, be willing to learn. Be willing to learn. Yes. Thank you, Michael. Yes. Be willing willing to to be educated, too. That's it. Yes. Be open minded. Be willing to be and put yourself in uncomfortable situations. Whether it's because you don't know what the fuck they're talking about, whether you don't know, whether you think you're wrong about what they're talking about, put yourself in those uncomfortable situations because that's the only way you're going to learn. That's the only way we're going to fucking have real change. Yes. I mean, change ain't coming with fucking us pointing the fingers and he's racist. That's not how change is going to happen. This bro. is definitely going to be a trailer on the Instagram page. Just saying. But yes, continue. 
I don't even know what I was talking about no more. Damn, I really cut I cut you off that bad. Uh, <laughs> topics over. Anyways, topics uh, over. Uh, educate uh, yourselves, empower yourselves. I got a I got a bunch like uh I had a bunch of coworkers um texting me this week. I don't know how they they find this podcast, but they found it. They it's definitely more. Found it. it's more every more, week. More every week. Every week. Every week. I listen to you, Mike. It's so good. Blah blah blah. So I don't know. Again, I'm at that point that I don't know if they're saying that because Mike, yeah, I texted you, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It sounds People good. People tell me this. It sounds good. But Lee, yo, be, yo, it sounds flex, good. flex, no. flex on yourself, Absolutely bro. Absolutely not. You're, you're talented, bro. You're talented. You're funny on this podcast. Yeah, yes, Mike. yo, to our millions of followers, I was listening to our ten, episode last ten to week. Followers. And NTD Studios, which you can catch only exclusively on SoundCloud uh, for licensing purposes, I guess. Yeah. Anyways, um, I have been getting the habit of listening to our episodes front to back after we record them for multiple reasons. But, you know, I threw I threw last week's on, you know, I was chilling, smoking. I was playing some PS4 and I forgot we were listening to our podcast. And Michael, mm-hmm. I remember just in general, the back and forth was dope. And I remember Michael specifically saying some shit, and I was laughing, forgetting we were listening to our was podcast. The, was it the nav thing? Because well, when you put that was, trail up, that shit had me crying. It was the nav thing. It that was me, one of me, them. It had me laughing. It was the scissors shit. There was more shit. There was the shit, like, and that's and <laughs> I texted got, Michael. They, got, Michael, they got my grand got SoundCloud because that scissors shit would have fucked me up in the house, boy. <laughs> boy! Oh, yeah. <laughs> fucked up in that house oh, You would have listened to that oh, shit no. So all, you, all your what? little fam- family members If you go back and snitch right now duh, I'm <laughs> having a fucking problem <laughs> Have a good house right now Please <laughs> Please <laughs> Hey, Don't do this. This is the art, though. You know, you can't take anything. We got you. Got to take everything we say here for now, a grain of salt. Let me tell you everything. Something. The the beauty about my relationship is that is that Kayla knows that sixty percent of the time, like I'm just I just. I just blurted out. Like, I just, it's a joke. And you gotta <laughs> right, love right, me for right, it. Like, you gotta yeah. love the, like, yeah. like these are the jokes. It people. works for you guys. Yes, yeah. these works. are the jokes. If you're not fucking with that, like, I'm not the guy for you. Like, that being it? said, Michael's trying to pivot from the main point I was trying What's to make. Oh, yeah, I was. Michael. I, was. <laughs> I definitely was. Michael, you funny as fuck. Yeah, uh-huh, uh-huh, lean in. Uh-huh, lean in. Uh-huh, I'm saying you find a lane for yourself. Bro, we already touched this. I don't like compliments, bro. I don't know how to react with compliments. You'll figure it out. No, Kayla's literally getting her master's degree so she can teach you how to feel those feelings. Shout out. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> well, I was I was speaking of that. I was the other night we're over here. She's uh we're putting Kenny to bed. We're on her floor. She got her textbook out and shit. I start uh I start reading. I'm like, yeah, let me read with you. Fuck it. I mean, she's in the middle of a chapter about schizophrenia, bro. <laughs> and when I said yeah, it, it, it was one paragraph, bro. That one paragraph took me. 20 minutes. I had to keep re- rereading yeah, it because I'm yeah, just like, yeah, yeah. what the fuck did I just read right now? <laughs> what am I reading? Like, this right. sounds like fucking gibberish. Like, uh-huh. uh, 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 I'm, I'm a dummy. That's for sure. Uh, <laughs> nah, I'm, I'm exactly where I needed to be fucking doing hard labor because uh, the books wasn't for me. Definitely not. Nah, but you Oh, maybe it was. Though, and right? I just, uh, you chilling. I love it. I yeah. love it, man. Uh, oh, my daughter, do- my daughter turned uh, two. I was just on about to say, yeah. Shout out to shout Ke- out to, to, to Kendall Mendoza. Shout out to her. She's the, the, the light the of my little, fucking the life, bro. Princess, man. Yo, I can't believe it's already been two years, bro. That should be that's just mind boggling, bro. And I hadn't seen her since like the holidays because of COVID and all that yeah, stuff. Yeah, I think I saw her. And she started getting mad hyper. She talks like way more now. She's she's she can't. She don't shut the fuck up. She get she got a little attitude too. Oh god, you can already see it. Yeah, yeah, that's that Natalie. Oh, yeah. You know? <laughs> fuck yeah, yo, that's that bullshit. Oh, now yeah. she does a little um, she does a little thing where she does a te- t- uh like when she's about to throw a temper chamber. She does. I wish we had video, but she like she clenches the fist right, and then like her head's like just, just starts shaking. Oh, you know what God, I mean, I know and I'm just know. like, oh, that's me. That's, I've done that. <laughs> I've done that many say, times. <laughs> that is me you right know, there. You, that's you, not that. That's fucking me. You might me have right to there. nip that in the bud. <laughs> she's Real like, oh, I'm she's like, oh shit, she's about to turn Super Saiyan three, and she's gonna swing on somebody. Oh no, she's already swinging. Yeah, so shout out to Kendall since we're already on shout outs. Shout out to Mariah Rosario and her brand. I don't even know how to pronounce it, to What's be honest. Brand? What's that? Fer, 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 fer. <laughs> Hold on, time on, time on, time on, time on. Before we shout out a brand out here, get the fucking pronunciation right, bro. How dare you? Yeah, hey, I bought a shirt, okay? Like, how, much how much was the shirt? How much was the shirt? It was 35 bucks. Damn, she's selling that for 35. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Can you believe no. <laughs> no, I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. I fuck nah, with it. I fuck with it. I fuck with it. Shout out to She's out here doing her shout, thing. Shout know, out to her, she, man. Shout out to her. I, I want a shirt. I want uh, a shirt now. Another shout out to uh, Pink Herbal, Cindy, who runs that. That's Ridge's uh, girl. Where? I bought some soaps from her. And nice. they were dope. I bought a detox soap. And nice. And I never... She gave me... Oh, I bought a little pack. So it was like a detox soap. Word. Uh, like a moisturizing soap and a, like a everyday type soap. 
and they're dope. Cause I like all that those natural soaps and shit. I can't I can't rock with like the Dove no more. Dove for men and shit. Like hmm? Yeah. Why not? It's I feel like it dries out my skin like a motherfucker. It dries my dries out my skin. O D O D. Those soaps. Word. Word. Yeah. I don't I, like I don't like feeling like an alligator out here. Word. I probably put on lotion once a week. Like fuck out it, lotion. <laughs> what, what do I need that for? Uh. I'm on the streets, cause <laughs> Ashy is up. Are you fucking nuts? Oh shit! Fuck you! I don't need no fucking lotion. Ashy how you fucking? <laughs> how you come out the shower talking about talking about my skin's dry? Yeah. Like nigga, I'm wet. Like, what the fuck you mean? <laughs> he said, I mean, nigga, you don't dry off and you be dry as fuck. You be ashy as fuck. That's the point to dry <laughs> off, my nigga. I'm putting on clothes. What the fuck is this shit? Speaking of soaps, you know what uh, I was thinking about the other day, yo? These. What was um? What's that Dominican soap that our parents always used to have? Let me sol. No, uh, or let me sol. Oh, no, that. Habon le que? Le guava. guava. Let me sol. Like what is the that? What is that? What is, what is that for? Habon le guava. I think that's for your, that's for the the totos, the tots. Is it? I think so. Is it though? I think that's what it's mainly. I feel like because I feel like every time that soap was in my house or my aunt's house or wherever it was, it was always like, "Oh, that's my soap. Don't touch it." And I think. And I think Damn, no one warned me. me in my house. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck I is could this? I could be wrong. I could be wrong. I hope you're but wrong. I, but I, I fucking but I think, pray. I think that this serves a key pray purpose to that soap. Is I think that that cleans the thoughts. Wow. Yeah. Good to know. You but see, I you learn something new every day. There you go. Even though that might not be true, but in my head, it's fucking facts now. Yeah. 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 You know how you know facts. how that works. Now he's thinking about every single time he took a shower with that soap. <laughs> hey, <laughs> shit's real. I mean, um. White people don't even have fucking loofahs, so right. White people don't use, it. but I I don't use a loofah either though, because I use just my own bar of soap. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. And then my and then yeah, that yeah. bar of soap usually has like those like exfoliating shits mm, that scrub mm-hmm, you. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But yeah, if I'm I don't be I don't I rock with that sharing soap shit. Sh- up sharing, sharing soap, soap shit. Word, word. <clears throat> it's, yeah, I, I got my own bathroom now, so it's just like I, I don't even. It's whatever. I've been kicked out of my. Did I tell you that I built the bathroom? I got kicked out of there. You can't use that bathroom that you. No, built. not at all. That's terrible. Not at all. She said, "Yo, you, you're just too dirty when you get out of work. So, uh, damn. you could just use so the upstairs kidding? musty shower." Damn, Kayla, how you gonna do my man like that, man? I mean, I, I, I guess, I guess. I mean, you deserve you deserve one like no, 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 like no. filthy day. You go in there and you and you blow that bathroom out. You take a fat shit and you take. Well, a I was just, I was thinking like when I was telling my man Black about this, he's like, "Yo, Mike, just pimp out the second one." And then what's she gonna do then? I was like, she probably <laughs> had me wash off in the fucking <laughs> side the of the house. <laughs> she probably had you put the, the shower in, that, in that yard in the back. You get an outdoor shower. That's another thing, though. That's another dilemma that's going on in my house. Every time I do a project, the it's like she's like, "Oh, but we should do this." Like, yeah, but my neck. Can can I get a break here? Right. Can I get a break here, yeah. please? Like. Jesus Christ, I've been going hard on this house since fucking quarantine, dog. As yeah. soon as I get something done, it's like, this would be nice. <sighs> <laughs> Speaking oh, of God. nice, you know what came out today? I don't what know if you've out? been sitting on this game, fucking Last of Us 2. That came out today? That came out today. I didn't even, I didn't, let, let me tell you something. That game is fucking crazy, incredible. It's like a fucking, it's a film. You bought it? Yeah, I bought it. I bought it last night and PS4 played me because I thought it was going to download while I was in rest. And I woke up to play it. And it's in, you need no. to download it. So then I fucking put it to download, go downstairs, go for a run, get my workout in, whatever, blah, blah, blah. Went upstairs. Come back, the PS4 needs to get updated. Like, Love okay, that. y'all Love really, that. y'all, what's going Love on over that. here? But yeah, I, got, I played like the first 20, it's like a, like a movie, it's literally like a movie. I, I can't, like, I bought Last of Us 1 and I just dropped it. Like, I don't even know how long into it. Really? Yeah, I really I did. I love that game. Did you? Yeah, I did. I like those, I like those single player, like, those games, like, cause I, I feel like I, just take it for what it is. It's like you're playing through a fucking dope ass movie. No, for sure, for sure. You know, it wasn't that good for me though. Yeah, it just wasn't. It ain't, can, you try like, playing online. I never played the online. My boy never. liked the online a lot, and I never. was like, yeah, I don't. I wasn't fucking with the online, but I liked it. Uncharted, never fuck with them neither. Uncharted was fun, but I started even after playing the new ones, I would would never drop a single dime and play that game. Like if the only way I'm playing that game if, is if it's free, free for free ninety nine. Word. <clears throat> So, no, nah, I'm definitely not going to buy The Last of Us 2. I mean, that's what it is, right? Last of Us 2? Last of Us 2. Yeah, yeah, I'm not, I'm not buying yeah, that. Yeah, I'm amped to play. I'm probably going to play that when I get home. As soon as you get home. Yeah. I mean, I do love that feeling of having a good video game that, like, literally that's all you're thinking about. To it's play, like, right? You're yes. Just yeah, at work. And I'm, just like, fucking, yeah, and, and I'm just like, yeah, I can't wait till I get home. But ah, that's a whole other. Those, those, those are one of the few emotions that I miss from being a child. 
Like those are like those are those. No, childish. no, but you still get that now, though. That's what, but yeah, but that's what I mean. Like yeah, those yeah, are yeah. the one, the one, I guess one of the few emotions that I still feel like. Yeah, for that sure. remind me of being for a sure, kid. for sure. That remind definitely like. But then, but then, like, I, like, like, I, like at this point in my life, bro, you know how hard it is to just sit there and turn on the PS4 and play. Like when I got my daughter next to me, like yeah, I just feel like 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 as a man, as a husband, like how can you sit there and play a video game with your family next to you, bro? Like right. how? How can you do that? You know what I mean? Like, right. you don't think your fucking son and your daughter wants that attention? Like, you're going right. to put it on that? Like, right. Like, yeah, that's why like you definitely got to make time for this for yourself. For me, for like, me. Is, play, but, like, I can't imagine that. Like, having kids and then video games. Like, I really have to make time for video games. In my I, life. Legit. I have to make time for video that games. Sounds, like, that sounds like, like, I, like, like, like when I had a good video. <laughs> I forgot what was the last good one that I was, like, super, super into. Like, I will go home. And I would be happy about having that thirty minute window with nobody in there, yeah. So I could just game yeah. it, bam. And as soon as the family's home, I right, shut it down. You know what I mean, or or like I wake up mad early every day. So Saturday, Sundays, when I'm up at six, and and Kayla Kenny's not waking up till nine, I got three solid. I smoke. I'm yeah. in that living room going hard. You know what I mean, yeah, that's yeah, my yeah. time. But like. I can't even do the fake fucking give her a controller and like yeah, it wasn't just I don't YouTube. feel I don't feel good doing that, bro. Yeah, I don't understand how could you like I mean yeah. Well, I don't. But maybe I don't know. Maybe it'll be different when I, I have like, a son. If I have a son, God willing, right. like I mean, like maybe it'll be different then. Like I could pa- like <clears throat> I have sex is too because I should be able to pass that on to my daughter too, right? Yeah, video games. Yeah, if she likes it, if you like it, if if that's something she'll like, that's cool. I feel like. What you said, I feel like that's definitely true. I feel like when it's just when it's just you two, like that bonding experience, you could have that. But like, yeah, I feel like getting laws like you can't like you're not gonna throw on Last of Us and play that next to your kid because no. you got a fiend on that game. Yeah, but you can play a game of two K or like a like a quick not even game of shit. Not, yeah, I just it's, tried. It's like one quick shit and then you can turn it off and like they play. No, 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 no. I just tried that the other day and, really? and, and like and like Kayla was there, so she had Kendall right. And I'm on an online game, but my daughter, like, I'm right. I'm busting dudes out. My daughter keeps walking right past me, bro. Like, uh-huh. what am I doing with my life, bro? Uh-huh. My daughter's hey, right like, here. Get out the way. Get out the way. <laughs> yeah, get out the way. Like, come on. Yeah, come yeah. on, son. Nah, son. Nah. <laughs> Uh, Father's Day is approaching. Shout out to the fathers out yeah, there. Yeah, shout out to all the fathers out no there. Bullshit, shout out to man. my father. I'm in his studio. Word. Which hopefully will be my studio one day. So shout out Word. to Sola Garcia. I love you very much. Word. Um, Julian Mendoza, you already know. Uh... Should I get into my father today? It's up to you, my friend. My father's nickname was Hitler growing up in my house. La Miela. He's a dictator. What he says goes. Okay. And that's that was that's it. Like I mean, like I'm I am the best of my father and like the total opposite of him. Cause mm-hmm. like he was a he was a provider. I mean, that's what he did. Yeah. He provided and then he was gone. I mean, I, I wanna be that and more. Like I mean, like right, right, he right. just gave me the blueprints of how to do that. And definitely don't do that. Like I mean, like yeah, yeah, yeah. So, but I still like, like, he's not the type of guy to say I love you. Mm-hmm. you know what I mean, he's not that type of dude. He's right. not like a hugging type of guy. Like I mean, but um, but I fucks with him. I think out of like, like honestly, out of like both my brothers, like I fuck with him the heaviest. You know what I mean, okay. yeah. Just cause like, like even though he's the dirt bag to my mom and all that, like I understand. I literally understand. I understand. I'm not gonna. I'm. I don't want to be that guy though. I, my goal is not to be that guy. You but understand, I understand you can forgive him now, right? Or like that's what you want to call it. Yeah, I you could call it forgiving. I guess I, I just, I, I understand. Word. That's all. That's all I know. Word. So that um, was, that was, I felt that one. Shout out to the fathers. I, I was shout not the, expecting that. Michael's been all over the place. Shout out today. to the Yo, real shout fathers. Out to Michael. Shout out to the real yeah, fathers. Shout out to out you, there. Michael. You're also a father, yes, bro. Shout out to <laughs> shout me. Out, shout out to you. I, like I think that's my, that's my favorite hat to wear. I mean, I like I wear that proudly. Like yeah. I mean, I brag about being yeah. the type of dad that I am. Like I mean, happy Father's Day to me because I be sunning all them niggas on PS4 at my house. Okay, you know. Okay, um, you know Jesse knows what he's talking about. You know Tekken, Smash, basically anything two player, y'all can get the smoke except for his COD or any shooter. Where can't shoot? I ain't Word. a shooter. How about like uh, <laughs> sports games? Sports games, I he fell off play? with 2K, MLB. Does he oh, no, even no. do he play? No? Jesse, the only the only games me and Jesse mutually play are like single player games or fighting games. But like he's he likes playing a lot of COD and all that shit. Um, yeah, he likes playing COD and single player. And I like playing like MLB The Show and fucking single player shit. Word. <clears throat> but yeah, that was a joke. I'm not. 
I'm not no daddy that I know of. <laughs> I had a joke in my head right now, but I was just like, Mike, the consequences of that. Really? Way too much. Ah, way too much. Oh, way too oh much. yeah. Oh, oh, cross uh, I th- oh, yeah, I think I just picked up all oh, the vibes. Oh, we'll, set. We'll um, uh, what else is new, Jeremy? Talk to me. Talk to me. We got the studio equipment coming. In. Matter of fact, I got to cash app you. Uh, I'll use some bread. I don't yes. like I want nobody no money. Yeah. I'm about to do that right now. Word, word. So we got some equipment said, coming in, since right? Since this, this episode is going to come out Monday, I'll is shout it? out. Yeah, I'm going to drop on Monday. Okay. Yeah. Right. Um, shout out my boy Manny. It's his birthday. His birthday's in, on bum, 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 Sunday. Bum, bum. So by the time this, this shit is out, shout, so out, shout to out to Manny, Manny Jordan, yeah. the homie that on me all day one. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <clears throat> there are only two Dominicans at PCD for like actually, a, yeah, for like two years. <laughs> but um, yeah, shout out to him, bro. Appreciate you. Love you, bro. Um, yeah, happy birthday. Um, I got all my shout outs out the way. You got any good news? Are we done? No. Yeah. I was about Chilly. to say, damn, bro, we done? We getting kicked out already? Um, <laughs> no, 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 no. Good news? No. You got good news? Mm. Where? Mm. Yeah. No, that's, we that's still kind of on that time for that. That's the time know? that I'm on, too. Huh? I ain't got nothing good to share with nobody. Yeah. Um, I miss my friends. I'll tell you that, man. I miss the whole group together and uh, weekend shindigs. Like your homies or like the the group chat, the group chat, the homies. My my homie, I see them all the time. Like Word. that ain't that ain't shit. I'm popping my name. Yeah, the group, on the group chat group is um, yeah, we've been we haven't been active you know, on any level. Word. Word. <laughs> but Since I see that first I fight. see Julian Jeff every weekend though. Yeah, right, right. You do Jeff, every you, weekend. Yeah. So I, like when I chill with them, I just be like, damn, I, where, where's everybody else at? Like I mean, like I love them to death. Like, like more pleasant, baby. Yeah, I, and I be saying that too. Like, I need to just pull up over there more, but it is what it is, man. Again, daughter's there, right? Then after that, it's like <clears throat> I'm tired. I don't fucking want to. I'm out of here. I think I'm becoming very. Uh, again, I don't even want to get into all that. I ain't even trying God to get into damn, all that. God damn, yo! I wish we needed. We need to start thinking about uh, recording this on video because. Takes away from half these, these jokes. Just the body language. Where, you know where I, I feel you. I feel you. I feel you. I feel you. Um. Uh. So yeah, we got some equipment coming in. So um. Yeah, shout out to that. We're trying to make some moves. Make us make our own studio. Just cause uh, whatever. Fucking let the the fans know. Like uh, these time slots that we do suck. Like yeah, they let they literally suck. They're like in the dead middle of the day. In the middle of the like, day, and then we got we we've been like even this weekend we both got shit to do, so now we're scrambling yeah. Friday afternoon. Even though I don't mind this, mm-hmm. there's no this thing, it wasn't that bad for me, but mm-hmm. nah, it's yeah, just was, not ideal. Like these it's times, not. it's just not ideal. It's, it's not. not like we should be able to just pick up and do the shit whenever we want. But um, I'm just scared of quality. Like we came in with a. Legit studio. Now we're going to we'll work on it. It won't be. It, the, it won't be the same. No. but I heard my boy's gonna help us out. So shout out to Connor too. He's gonna help us out with the side on this Word. podcast. And he does sound on on unrepresented representatives. So shout out to them too. Mm. Um, Have you been listening to their podcast lately or no? Yeah, I listened to the episode they dropped. Well, after, they did do one a week or yeah, no, nah, no, nah, because there's there's just a lot more like thematic and like they have a concentrated shit that they like to talk on. So they they do seasons, like they have like. And they they do a guest every episode, mm. and um and I think they've been a little bit more quiet because the new season was coming out this year, but like they've just uh been dialing back because of COVID, but they did drop an episode after all that George Floyd shit. Like the basically I think it was the day before I dropped the fucking emergency episode, and um yeah I listened to that that shit was great. Um they're still out there doing the, their thing so That's shout out to up, them. Shout out to them. But yeah uh my boy Connor does sound for their podcast and their podcast sounds. Really good, word. Especially after being a guest on it, because they did it in the living room in word. New York and Brooklyn. So, word. yeah, that's exciting. Yo, we're still, you know, we're getting our own studio situation going. So that's always that's always fun. As a studio, we mean we're gonna get a room and put equipment. In. That's how that's how it starts, yo. That's, it. that's how it starts. Uh, <laughs> fuck. There was more shit I wanted to touch on, and I'm drawing a blank. This is why um, these winged podcasts, I like it. Yeah. But then I kind of like that those ones that we have a straight like uh. We have an agenda. Yeah, not an agenda, but just a, a checklist. It's an outline. An outline. It's a outline. checklist. Yeah, so, yeah. Just so like times, like like literally on the way from work, I'm like, oh, I could touch on this, this, that. Yeah, I wrote when you right before you text me, you were ten minutes away. I was on the Google Doc, just writing some little shit. I should, probably should have told you. I just wrote the fucking cause shit. So, 
Make sure I didn't forget my shout outs. Word. Everything else was Word. <coughs> um stuff like that. Let's see, let's see what I could talk about. Um this is guy at work, yo. And uh every day I want like like I have visions of smashing his face. <laughs> <laughs> no bullshit. Yeah. He has he hasn't tried me yet. He hasn't tried me yet. But the two dudes that I work right next to, right, he's our boss at this job site, and he and he's always yelling at these dudes, right. But he's not he's nice to me because I think he knows that I got a temper. It's already known in that in the mm-hmm. company. Like I've done spaz on a few people, so he hasn't he hasn't we haven't been on that time yet. Like like he hasn't tried me yet. Right. But the way that he talks to them. You're just waiting. For I'm your waiting. Turn. You're I'm waiting, waiting for your turn. I really am. I really am. I'm waiting for him. <laughs> I really am. I was oh just talking to another God. coworker, another boss, that called me on the way home, and I told him, like, yo, get me on your crew, because I honestly, at this point, like, I know it's coming. Today, I thought it was going to be the day, because, like, it, but this is the problem, Jeremy. You got to keep that same energy, bro. Right. You can't just be on some yelling dickhead shit, and then two minutes later, you want to crack jokes and be cool with the guys. Like, right. Now I feel fake. You know what I mean? Right. I feel fake. Because now I got to crack jokes with you and blah, blah, blah. Right. But I know right but after this break, you're going to go back to fucking being a dickhead. Right, 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 right. Not to me, but just in general. Right? Uh-huh. So if I don't fuck with you here, like, why am I cracking jokes with you over here? Like, you know what I mean? Right. Like, Is he like I, a manager, though? Or like, he's a is foreman. He, is he a, okay. He's a foreman. So, I, I mean, like, is he like... A day? No, I'm just curious for the situation. Right, I feel like a lot of a lot of it too could just be like since he's your manager, like he's just compartmentalizing those two things. Like he's gonna be your, uh, your dickhead manager. No, 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 no. no. But you could get shit done without being a dickhead, though. I agree. That's yeah. true. 100. percent That's very true. You could be. You could get a lot of shit done without and have fun while you're doing it. Yeah. In dangerous environments, bro. Trust me, I've done did it. Yeah. With other foreman. Yeah. Which, yeah. We have fun. Like we busting balls, we cracking jokes, we're getting the work done at the same time. Right. There's no screaming. There's no yelling. Someone fucks up. Like, yo, nah, it's all good. Do this. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. This dude, this dude was yelling at someone for pulling out nails out of wood, not straight. You, you got to put them out. You're not pulling those nails out straight. <laughs> you got to bend those <laughs> yeah, nails you, back. We got to use those again. It. Motherfucker, we're talking about a what? multi-million dollar company. Don't talk to me about bending nails back, bro. So purposely, I yank nails out. Uh-huh. Fucking as fast as I can, and chuck them. <laughs> I start chucking them. Like I like, I'm waiting. Oh I'm shit! Waiting. I, I've been, I'm poking the bear. I like I'm this. I'm poking the bear. Uh-huh. Don't wait and for him, uh-huh. dog. Cause the the like he he don't want it. Uh-huh. I know he don't want. He knows that he don't want it. Right. So even if me and him have a little thing, he's not. He's gonna he's gonna back off. Right. Uh-huh. I'm gonna walk up. I'm not get to another job site. Exactly what I want to do. Or he gets froggy. I put hands on him. <laughs> it's a win-win for me. That's what you gotta understand. It's a win-win for me. Let's go. It's a win-win, dog. So I'll keep y'all posted on that as yes, I keep poking this bit. Because like I've been. God in- damn it! I wish I had something for the soundboard for this story. God damn! I gotta work on that. Continue, yo. That was <laughs> my, my boy. My boy's out here, yo. So no, no, it's just something that's been like it's really been like 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 yo that shit like triggers me, dog. Like. Like and yeah. these other dudes, like these other dudes, they're grown men. Like for, yeah, for yeah. me, I I I'd be looking at them like, yo, how you not saying something back to the, this guy? Like, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Well, you just gonna, but it's a job at the end of the day, I guess. And people are thinking about their livelihoods and shit. But fuck all that. Yeah, yo, uh, fuck all of that. You yeah. crazy? Especially the work that I like. I I, I put in work. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. I don't think there's no one that puts in more work than me. I put. I say it proudly. Don't no one put in more work than me. You heard? So for someone to ever say something, that's when I that's why I really be waiting. Like, yo, I'm waiting for someone to fuck. I'm wait, I I just I, <laughs> I live for shit like that. I really do. I'm waiting for you to fucking yeah, try. Yeah, me. yeah, yeah, yeah. I used to think a lot like that when I bartended, cause my, my fucking hated the manager. And towards the end of that, I would just drink on the job too. And she was just like you said, just micromanaging on some bullshit and just like Yeah. That shit's annoying. Word. It's, I don't have like a specific story. I did like yell at her a couple of times, I remember. Not yet, like yell at her, but like, Word. like yeah, she would come in and like on some crazy micro man, like I would just clean the counter and she'd come back and clean the counter. Just like little stupid shit like that. Mm, like, mm. like you said, like the nail shit. Like mm. that's like dumb micromanaging shit. Like shit that's, that not, has, that's not uh, how, that's not what it, like that's not a good manager. No. That's no, not no, what no, no. Let me tell you something. Do. Like he's knowledgeable, right? In yeah. this field. Very knowledgeable. Been doing this since he's 18, yeah. right? So you're fucking yeah. damn near 40 now. You better fucking be good at this, right? Yeah. But there's a difference between 
there's like some people just don't know how to be leaders. Like right. they, they like even though you're a boss, you're not a leader. You don't know how to command a group and get like and rile up the troops. You know what I mean? Yeah. To have a good like bro, having good vibes, like that's just gonna make the like your job's gonna be better. It's gonna go smoother. Like yeah. And once you start screaming and yelling, it's it's already high pressure situations. Right. Now you're screaming and yelling. I, you got everybody on Everyone's there. on yeah. edge now. Yeah. You know, you think that's yeah. making them better? Like Right. The funniest part, right? The funniest part is that me and this dude, well, like like we be smoking sometimes guy. He's a fucking pothead. I mean, just like me. I remember one time we was going up to the Christmas party and he was like, Yo, you wanna ride just ride with me? Fuck it. So I rode up with him. And I told him, I said, Yo, bro, this was the beginning of this, right? The beginning of it. <clears throat> this was Christmas. So where we at? July now? June? So I told him, I said, yo, bro, the way that you be yelling at these kids, right? Because as soon as he yells at one of them kids, right, they run off with, the, like, chickens with their heads cut off, right? Yeah, yeah. And we're in fucking, we're we dealing with 10 feet holes, shit in there. I'm like, yo, you're going to yell at them, right? They're going to stop panicking. Mm-hmm. They're going to get hurt. And guess what? That's your fault. Right. It's your fucking fault. Right. You can't be fucking yelling at these kids for no fucking reason, dog. Right. Like, that's not how you, but probably one day. Are you listening, other. Mr. Foreman? That's not how you run a squad, my guy. I mean, whatever, man. The characteristics of this dude, too, anyways. I, it would let you know what type of dude he is, anyways. Right, so, right. I, yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I don't want to... Let's, wanna... let's, not, let's, not let's not reopen that can. Or open that can. Yeah, I'm, I'm, done, I'm done with that one. Go fuck yourself, you <laughs> <laughs> Just like that, baby. Um, yeah, yo. What else is going on, Jamie? God damn, now I'm going to New York this week. What are you calling. doing in New York? When are you coming it's back? It's my friend's birthday. I'll, call, I'll be back like Tuesday. I'm leaving Sunday. I'm leaving either Saturday night or Sunday morning. Where? <clears throat> and it's your boy's birthday? Yeah. Manny's what? birthday. Oh, oh, yeah. oh that's what you're yeah, celebrating yeah, yeah. with him. Yeah. Even though it's today. No, it's Sunday. Oh, it's Sunday. It's on Sunday, yeah. Oh, oh, oh but you shout it out. I shout it out because the episode's coming out Monday. I understand. You know, you got to look out for the future. I, uh, for the future uh, self. Word, word, word. So mm-hmm. what are y'all doing over there? Uh, me, him, a couple of friends got a uh Airbnb by like Rockaway Beach in Queens, and we're just gonna be chilling there for a couple of days. Go to the beach on Sundays, keep Word. it low key. Word, it's gonna be very nice. How you getting out Much there? Needed. Spanish bus? Nah, I'm driving. You gonna drive the max? Yeah, it's like to and from. Like I'm not like driving around and shit. Like once you're in the city, it's just to get to the city, basically. Yeah, yeah, so. yeah, yeah, yeah. Tu sabe. Max be. is good to go out there. Or? The max, yeah, the max is good because I took it to I took it for an oil change. And other changes, like I was the change the oil, the AC, fix the window, fix the seat. I did that the other day. Got to check the tires tomorrow before I head out. Where shit like that, do something. Like, we good. Nah, we nah, good. Yeah, yeah. Just like, try to make sure like, that you don't get stuck in Connecticut somewhere because the max blew out on you. Right. Yeah. That I mean, because that would suck. That would suck. When you could just take twenty dollars and hop on the Spanish bus. Now nah, it's like forty bucks. That's still forty bucks. I know. You gotta spend that in gas. I know, but I'm more driving my own DJ. I'm chilling, comfortable, and I, I can guess. leave or never. I guess. I guess. This is how it. I am a hands. Yeah. Free no free move. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Nah, but yeah, I'm, I've been low key, man. They've been going to the beach a lot at the house. Um, I went last Friday quick with them, but like, I didn't feel like going to the beach because it's just like the beach. The beach not ruins because it's a good day. It's a well day, like little vacation day spent. But like a day at the beach, a day drinking at the beach fucks up that day and then it fucks up the next half of the next day because you're just so tired from the you, beach you're fucking drained yeah you just drain and i'm you know I'm, I, trying to I'm do scared shit, to so. take i'm scared to take my daughter to the beach honestly i, I don't really know that's one of those things that i want to do like how like so it's like not to go in the water like no it's just like too many people she has not been around like mad people before there, there's beaches that you could like there's them beaches in like newport or, like little compton or some shit like that that are like not that big you can take her there first she get comfortable being around you. You know what I'm saying? But there's be there's like small beaches where you can take. It's not it's like not that crowd. It's not like a Mesquama kit. It's where, like a party where. beach. Actually, I'm, I'm, it is. my man is like a party beach. Yeah, but my man's about to come down. He told me in like two <clears throat> weeks he's gonna go down to Mesquama kit. I'm gonna go meet him out there and shit. My boy, boy from Boston. And shit. It's nice. The water's co-worker. fucking brick. I went in last Friday. You went to Mesquama kit. We went to Mesquama kit. Yeah. Met up with them after we put up. I was putting up fences at my in my backyard with my grandfather, and my dad. I met up with them after, and that shit was a. The water was brick. Water was was it brick. packed? It was packed. Well, I yeah. bet it was. Yeah. That's that shit. Si, senor. So, that's the only time I think I'm going to go to the beach. It's like me and my, me and my co-workers out there. I mean, because they, they, somehow, like, Patty's always comes up on their feed. He's like, yo, Mike, have you ever been? I was like, yo, it's fucking lit over there, bro. The one time I went, I'm pretty sure the fucking cover fee was like 
fifty dollars or some bullshit. Fuck it, pay it. <laughs> he said, "Fuck it." It fuck was it. lit pay in there it. though. Pay it, it was lit in there though. Fuck, fifty dollars, dog. You got money. Damn. You got. You, you ain't broke. Yeah, I'm broke, baby. What you mean? I'm nah, broke. I'm nah, broke. nah. I'm nah broke. I see. I smell money. Yeah, I can smell money, bro. You money. You got yeah. money, you know. Look at that smile. Look at that smile. They just get a haircut today. Don't no broke nigga smile like that. (laughs) That's facts. Broke broke (laughs) niggas don't smile, bro. They smirk. I mean, he said broke niggas don't smile. Broke they niggas smirk. don't smile, man. Ain't nothing, ain't nothing funny yeah. in this world, cuz. Yeah, them not COVID funny. checks still, you know, they still clearing. I'll tell you that. I got a quick question that I just want a yes or no to, I buy, and I don't want no nothing after that. Okay. Um, Is our friend talking to you yet or no? No. Nah. That's, that's. <laughs> hey. That was, that. <laughs> yeah, that that's, a, that's a fat no. That's a fat no. Oh, God, it's it's. He'll be all right. No, I'm not. He'll be. And all right. I, I'm trying to be all right, not to fucking say nothing right now. But I, yeah, because when you, when you pull when you pulled up the other day, or you know when we pulled. Oh, up, I can't was, wait. I can't to pull wait. Pull up on him. Oh, I can't wait. And, my, and like Michael's that's the, This that is petty. the same type of yeah. situation so, with yeah. my manager. <laughs> yeah. I want to go over there and poke the bear. <laughs> that's what I want to do. Cause yo, <laughs> we can't be we can't be like this though. We can't be on some fake shit though. We cannot. Especially with like real friends and family, dog. It, it don't make no fucking sense to me, dog. Yeah. It's really like, nah. I want to go. I, I need to. I need to. Pull That's a mission of mine. No, I have to. Pull up. Oh, no, I got, have yeah. to. Yeah. I gotta pull up. I gotta pull. I don't know if it's gonna be today, tomorrow. I gotta pull up. I absolutely gotta put up, though. There's no way that I don't. I've been texting him too. I've been giving like after I give him the the first full week, nothing. So I was like, whatever. I gave him the space. And then no, too we're, much, we're, too much. We're, we're going we too much into this. No, yeah, we're going right, too much. Right, into right, this. I don't even want to touch right. this. I really you're don't right. want to touch on this. I don't want to touch. You're it. I'm right. pulling up though. I gotta pull up. I'm poking a bit. I have to. That's me. This is what I. This, this no, is I what he to. does, ladies and gentlemen. To. I have to. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck are we doing? Like, I, <laughs> what the fuck are we doing? That's my yo. <sighs> Thank you, Michael. Thank you, Michael. Anyways, what else is new? I keep saying, is that like a that's a that's a transition? When I need, it, when I need to stop. Yeah, it, yeah, I need to stop that. <laughs> I need to stop that. Uh, <laughs> nah, I mean, fuck, yeah, nothing, bro. We we still here. We can sit here and bullshit for a little while. What we got like an hour in? Yeah, only an hour. In. You want to wrap it up? You wrapping it up? I don't know. Looks like I don't want to go home right now. I I, I mean I, I like the, I, I like the I like doing the podcast, but like yeah. like I said, I really uh we don't really got a fucking uh. A template of what we want to say today. Well, yeah, today was. Uh, this was like a a a, a real wing it podcast because we just yeah. we just decided to come in here right yeah, now. Last because we were gonna do it tomorrow, and then you. And then I realized that I got tickets. yeah, I got tickets to the aquarium at that so time. We like, oh, were gonna cancel, there? and then Michael was like, "No, nah, I can get here," so he got here. We, That's we the last thing here. I want to do, bro. Like we already yeah. skipped a week, and we yeah. have thirteen episodes, and like we want to keep canceling shit. That's all I thought. Like, no, 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 no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we do what we can. We when we can, we can. And it is. That's why we bought the. That's why we got the studio equipment coming yeah, exactly, in. You know, exactly. Because like, this should never be like we right. can't. Like, how can't? Why can't we? Right. No, nah, I feel that. You know what I mean, like, uh, we just we just sitting here talking. Like, what the fuck? We should be able to do this over the phone. We could. We 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 probably could have just learned how to do this over Zoom when COVID was a thing. Earlier, it still is, but like, right, fuck rather, that. I'd rather die. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I'd rather die. I'd rather just give up I'd on this podcast. I'd rather just die. <laughs> just give me the COVID. Uh, so yeah, die. no, but I guess, yeah, next next week we'll come, we'll come correct. This um, week we came correct, though. I, I like this episode. I feel like I like it. I, I got, I'm going to go back and listen to it, obviously. But, um, right. you know. I still have I not will. listened to a single episode. Whenever not even one. Whenever you get the chance. It'll never happen. Whenever we'll you get the chance, it'll never happen. When you, when we finally have those millions of viewers that you, you keep talking about, oh, they're here. Might. They're here. They're here. What's what's up, Drake? Jake. What's up, Lil Yachty? What's up, guys? <laughs> uh, damn it, dog! I don't want to leave, Jeremy. What can I say? Yo, I man, like look leaving. at oh, man. I want. <laughs> I'm not fucking leaving. I'm not fucking leaving. <laughs> I'm not fucking leaving. I'm not fucking leaving. Now we're leaving. God. All right, let's go. All right, guys. Uh, you dirtbags. Till next week. Word. Peace. Holla.